I have taught at a regular public school for 12 years. Um, and I have been searching for what we do here at Highland Academy. I've been searching for that um, emphasis on just the individual student. Um, you know, where I've come from, where uh, middle schools with you know a thou over a thousand students, you know, they almost feel more like numbers. Um, here, each student is important. Each student is known, um, and. We worry and we focus on each student. One thing I really like about Highland Academy is people think smaller is a bad thing when really at other middle schools you don't really get much of a hands-on education when here the teachers know you by your name and it's really just interactive. I really like the fact that the classes are small. They're so personable. Um, they get a lot of hands-on involvement with their teachers in the topics that they are learning. I really like that they um, are able to answer a lot of their questions. They have plenty of time for the students to ask questions and to work on their work during class. We've really benefited from that, um, being able to have free time more after school to do other activities because we are not so uh, loaded every day with hours and hours of homework because they accomplish a lot of it in class so we love that. Highland Academy is different from other schools in that the environment is much more positive. Uh, all of our teachers have bought into the program where we individualize in our instruction for our students. Um, all of our classrooms are smaller, there's a lot more access to technology. Um, we really provide students with the opportunity to excel uh, and to go at their own pace. You're not just a number like I feel like they would be at a public school. Um, here you get individual, everybody knows um, each other. All the teachers know all the students. Um, it's just a different type of one-on-one -on -one personal relationship opposed to you're just kind of going through all your courses and getting through. It's such a supportive environment for us. We get to make a lot of, you know, we get to make the decisions about how we're going to teach a unit or, you know, a, a lesson um, or a concept. And there, you know, no one's handing us a curriculum saying, you know, you have to read this scripted lesson, you have to do it this way. So by untying our hands, we're able to, you know, let our, our natural talents um, drive the way we teach.